This pumpkin right here is our waterfall. What's going on, Kaferos? Before you continue on with this video, I want to show you guys a song my friend Brett made. So this is manager, Brett's manager, Tim What's here. What's up? And uh, I, do, I didn't even know Brett was in the making of this song, and it came out fire. So I just want to roll a, a bit of the song. Here it is right here. Yep. It's, it's, it's hot. It is fire, and that's no pun intended, but that's what it is. It's, it's hot. So I'm going to cut the song right there. You can still hear it lowly in the background there, but I'm going to actually play this song throughout today's video. You got to go check it out. The links are in the description to download it. Do whatever you want with the song. Yeah. I know the Caferos are powerful. Tim does too. <laughs> That's right. Hey, go show Brett what's up. Show him some love. Listen to the song Fire it is by fire. Brett Hall. Yes, by it Brett is. Hall. Let's go do it. That. What is going on, Caferos? Welcome back to another video here. Today, we have an interesting video for you. It's currently 940, which is a perfect time to be inside right now, chilling. We got a pumpkin. Why do we have a pumpkin? I don't know if you saw by the thumbnail, but we are actually making the waterfall of this patio bowl right here, aquascape patio bowl. The waterfall for that is gonna be the pumpkin's mouth. We're gonna like carve a face out of it, probably something funny knowing us. I'm gonna make it look super cool, Halloween themed. This pumpkin right here is our waterfall though. So stay tuned, be ready. It's gonna be an awesome video, hopefully go on to enjoy it. This right here is the medium sized patio bowl by Aquascape, so it's super cool. As you know, I have one of these set up out front by the front door. Here's a quick look at that. It's pretty dope. It doesn't have any plants in it right now. I actually took them out because those plants are becoming like weeds growing up the wall and stuff. I got to replant new ones. So that's one thing you're going to need for this. Another thing is obviously the pump that is going to have the water coming from in the patio bowl out of the mouth of the pumpkin. This is a 400 gallon per hour little aquascape pump here, which is much more than we need. Perfect. Last but not least, the pumpkin. And uh, yeah, it was a process actually getting this pumpkin. I first bought one and walking out to the parking lot to get into my car, it was raining, I slipped, I fell, rolled the clip. Oh, the pumpkin, no, dude, are you kidding me? Paul. Gosh dang it. Good job guys. I have to hit the ground and let's go buy another one. And that up, uh, pumpkin. RIP. We did feed it to the pigs though, so it didn't go to waste. Now, pumpkin number two is our waterfall. So those three items right there are all you need to do this project right here. Of course, we're probably gonna end up getting some rocks and a few other little things, but you'll see that throughout this video. These are the main things you need in order to make this thing fish ready. All right, um, Paul, hey, so you're gonna need a tool, obviously. So what's your weapon of choice? To open this box? Yeah, yeah. bro, to open up the pumpkin, the, the, everything. What are you gonna use? Are you kidding me? A plastic knife. Are you kidding me? I'm not kidding. It's gonna work. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I think we're gonna go with the regular one. That is the most satisfying sound ever. ASMR, people. Like for more ASMR. Oh yeah, it's like Christmas morning. Shout out to Greg Whitstock for hooking it up with the beautiful brown patio bowl. My previous one is actually black. This is a brown one. We're gonna do it right here, right in the lot. These things are deadly. If you step on these, they become like suction cups. All right. Water pump. What is this though? Oh, he did not. Oh, yo, Greg snapped. Color changing lights with a remote. <laughs> yo. This is about to be real. Oh my gosh. So I guess this is one of his new products. Um, you could put it in like urns and stuff like that and uh, the remote literally changes the colors. You just go like this. I have it in my koi pond at my parents' house. By the way, by the way, big video coming up here soon. David, you know exactly what oh, I'm talking yeah. about, don't oh, you? Yeah. We're having the whole entire backyard. My parents' whole entire backyard is being redone. I'm talking new plants, turf, no real grass. It's all gonna be like legit turf so pristine. So be ready for that. I promise you it's gonna be worth the wait. I'm gonna film every bit of it. We're gonna be filming back there again a lot. So stay tuned. I'm sure a lot of you guys that love those old videos filming in my parents' backyard, it's coming back. You guys are gonna love it, enjoy it, and it's gonna look insane. I'm excited for it. I know your mom's excited. Oh, my parents are very excited. My mom, my dad, I know you guys are watching. Be ready, your backyard's about to be redone. This stuff right here is a necessity. This is just an add-on, so I didn't even know he sent this. Thanks, Greg. I don't have anything to do with this pumpkin carving with, so we got a kitchen knife. Think it's gonna work? Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. 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 We'll find out. What you doing there, Paul? A little pumpkin carving. By the way, the best thing is nothing goes to waste here on the farm. We got animals that'll just eat everything. 
That animal is a pig. We already threw the other one in the pig enclosure and they went crazy. I'm probably gonna end up doing a video like feeding my pigs and stuff pumpkins. You wanna see that? Let me know in the comments down below. Anything left over from this project is going right into the pig enclosure. They're probably still eating it as we speak. All right, oh yeah. Dude, the pigs are gonna go crazy on this. This is all pig food. That is like candy to them right there. Hey, while Paul's doing this, I, I got a question for everybody. If you are allergic and you can't carve pumpkins every year, drop it in the comments below. People get hives all over their arms. Is that you? I'm asking you now, so comment down below if you are. If you guys wanna see the pigs, Eat the inside of a pumpkin. Maybe I'll buy like five pumpkins, carve them up, and then put them in the enclosure and see what the pigs do to them. Like this video. If this video gets 15,000 likes. All right, we're drying the pumpkin right now. We got a Sharpie right here. We're actually gonna draw what we got going on here. So stay right there. I'm gonna turn around. Oh, you're gonna do show it you like... guys what I got in store for us. Check out how crazy this is gonna be. You guys are gonna be shocked. Just wait one sec. Oh, this is crazy. Are you ready? On the count of three, I'm turning this pumpkin around. You're gonna see what we're gonna create here. Three, two, one. Boom, baby. That right there is what I like to call a dope carb job. Now, now wait till the thing. David's laughing because he didn't, even, he didn't even know what I was gonna make either. I'm actually gonna carve this out now. It's really simple and I, the reason why I did it simple like that is because the water needs to pour out at a certain way. Otherwise, I would've done like a PC logo or something, you know? But, see you in about five minutes. Oh, <laughs> it's actually so fun. I haven't carved a pumpkin in, feels like to be 365 days. Maybe because that's since the last year. There it is. We are officially done carving. Got our uh, pumpkin capped off here. It is gonna be awesome when there's water flowing out of its mouth right there. Hopefully 400 gallons an hour. Should be pumping this thing insane. Look what else we got. Nice little snack treat for the pigs outside. So once again, you wanna see a video with this one? Just hit the like button. So we've got the rocks. We're gonna stack them in here in order to elevate that pumpkin above. You get what I'm saying now? It's gonna be crazy. And just like that, within seconds, our rock is in place. All we gotta do now is put our pumpkin. Just like that. Water level is gonna come up to about right here, and water's gonna be pouring out of its mouth. And in order to do that, we need to plug in our pump. Cut in a little hole, like that. Check inside. Water's gonna come right out of there. That's right there is ingenuity. Oh my gosh, I'm a genius. I am a genius. Let me tell you. This just made the video so much better. Color changing lights. I remember when I went to Pondemonium and these were a prototype, meaning not out yet. By the way, I'm filming a TikTok on this video at the same time as making this YouTube video. So if you don't follow me on TikTok, at Paul Cafaro, what are you doing? Look at this remote. You could literally just go like this and pick the color of what you want this to glow up at. This is gonna be crazy. Like when I mean crazy, I mean crazy. Oh, oh yo. Watch, look at this. Oh, look at that. That's going inside the pumpkin. Hit the subscribe button. If you have not done this already, join the family. There's a subscribe button down there below. Hit it for me, join it. Let's put this in there. Like that, it glows the pumpkin up, you know? Oh my gosh. Does it look insane? It looks sick. <laughs> All right. Keep going. Oh, the water everywhere. We're good! <laughs> <laughs> Look at her fill up. Look at that sucker fill up. This is just so beautiful. This is just a project. We're literally doing this in our kitchen. David and I are here building this in our kitchen just for the holiday spirit. I just want to say thank you everyone for being here watching this video right now. Literally nothing I do is possible without you watching and every once in a while I just like to say my thank you. So thank you to everyone watching this video right now. Uh, I hope everyone has a safe and happy holiday. This right here is how we celebrate 
Halloween. And by the way, we went so hard that we bought a smoke machine. So it's not even close to being done. This thing is gonna be insane. At the end of this, we're gonna have water up to there, coming out of the pumpkin's mouth, lit up, changing colors with a smoke machine. I mean, it doesn't get much better than that. First attempt on seeing what this thing does. We could have filled it up a little bit more, but we're gonna plug it in and see the filter do its thing. Oh, yo! It's coming out the eyeballs! Yo! It's coming out the eyeballs because we don't have a freaking pipe in there. Dude, it came out 150 times better than I could have ever imagined. That is the sound, like if you're a pond builder, like if Greg, you're watching this right now, all the pond builders out there, Jack, Ralph, everyone that's came and built my stuff in my house, Weston, listen to that. That's a pristine pumpkin waterfall right there. I mean, you tell me, that is... Ah! One more step, spider web. Let's, let's give our pumpkin a little hairdo there. There we go. And then a little more on this side. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. We're releasing smoke. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh! oh, oh. Holy moly. Yo, is it foggy? Yeah. That is so sick. I got the remote right here, and I could literally pick any color I want, like purple right there. Check it out, purple, purple. In my kitchen, yo! This is insane! Look at the light behind it. Do you see that? We just added that. So a little bit more materials went into this than we said initially. It was just the patio bowl, the pump, and the pumpkin at the first part. Now we got the patio bowl, the pump, rocks, Spider web, light behind it, light inside, and the hand we added to. David's the editor, so David behind the camera, just list all those on the side of the screen right here. Gotcha. That's how many materials you're gonna need, right there. Gotcha. Those are all them. That is it for today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed this amazing video. We just created this literally in my kitchen. Big shout out to Greg Whitstock, the pond guy from Aquascape for sending me these amazing products, the patio bowl, the pump, the light, everything. If you are interested in any of those products, I'll just have them linked down below. You can go check those out. By the way, I'm not getting paid for that. That is literally just me telling you a reliable product that I just created this beautiful thing with in seconds. Today's positive comment shout out goes out to Two people, two people. It's in reference from last video. If you haven't seen the last video, it was one of my favorite videos I've ever filmed. It's 22 minutes long, which is super long for my channel. And it is straight action-packed funniness. Like, literally, so funny. Here's a clip. Don't, seriously, don't move fast. Yo, yo, that is a long- The whole video is like that. Here's one of the comments. I was cracking up laughing when he realized they were scorpions. That was me realizing they were scorpions. You gotta go look at the video, because I freaked out. And then, uh, Clen, clean, Clen, Clen. Clanazzle. I don't know how to pronounce his name, I'm sorry. But he says in quotes, Yo, these things got a stinger? Get them off! It's one of the things I said when I saw the scorpions I had in my hand had stingers still. And then he said, I can't with dying laughing face emoji. Thank you both so much for the support on that video and to all those who supported the last video. The comments were absolutely hilarious. If you do want to win a positive comment shout out and have your comment on the screen in one of these different videos, all you gotta do is drop a positive comment down in the comments down below. And that is it. Boys and girls, hope we enjoy Happy Halloween. I know it's coming up here in just a couple days. Remember Brett Hall released that super cool song that you heard throughout this video. So go check out those links. They're in the description down below. If you have yet to do so already, hit the subscribe button. Oh! No! No! I Bro, legit, we just spent no, 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 so I, long. I legit did not mean to do that. Oh like, my gosh. I deserved it. I deserved it. Hit the subscribe button. Turn on post notifications. And until next time, we'll see you in the next video. Peace!